thousands of dives. One mission, to bring you incredible footage of marine wildlife. Southern right whales are massive, slow-moving giants that can grow over 50 feet long. Their thick blubber makes them incredibly buoyant, which tragically also made them the right whales to hunt. By 1920, the whaling industry had decimated the population of southern right whales to around only 60 females. One of the most distinctive features of the southern right whale are the white patches of rough calcified skin on their heads, known as callosities. These form due to large colonies of whale lice. And they help researchers identify individual whales thanks to their unique patterns. Each June, these whales begin arriving along the coast of South Africa, having migrated all the way from the icy waters of Antarctica to give birth in the relatively warmer waters. South Africa's marine protected areas like Dahoop and Walker Bay in the Western Cape provide vital, sheltered calving grounds. But scientists have noticed troubling signs. Southern right mothers are 23% leaner than before. The calving intervals have stretched from two to three years to only once every four to five years. The cause is thought to be linked to rising ocean temperatures. Later in the year, the whales must make their way back to the Antarctic to feed on krill that in turn feed on phytoplankton that lives beneath the ice but melting sea ice has drastically decreased the abundance of the whale's crucial food source. If you care about marine conservation and want to learn more about the ocean's wildlife, make sure to like, subscribe, and join us beneath the waves.